Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Uh, tonight I'm doing my coin challenge as well as my stuffing. Now I am finally caught up on my videos. I'm still about one day behind, but keep in mind I stuffed all this late last week. So I definitely don't have as much change and I probably have a little bit more rollover than I normally would. But that's okay. We're getting caught up and we'll get started. I did not count the coin ahead of time, so let me do that really quick. Let's see, $1, I'm gonna move this out of the way. Let's see. Okay, so there's one, 150, 160, 170, 180, 190. $2, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, and 13. 213. Do I have 213 on here? I do. Let's just take the easy out. Color 213. And put it in the gumbo machine. How is everybody doing? I hope everyone is doing well. I am doing good. It's just super busy here, super busy at work, super busy with kids' activities. All good things, just all at the same time. All right, so we got a lot of circles to color in. I'm hoping soon we can start getting a few each week. All right. I'm going to move this. I don't know if I like this new setup or not. We'll figure it out. All right. So here are my um, envelopes. I did go grocery shopping, but I did meal plan and I did not coupon this week. So there's extra there. Eating out is gone. Eating out doesn't even cover one meal anymore. <laughs> These boys are eating like crazy. All right, miscellaneous has five. I did get a couple fountain drinks this week because when I stress, I think caffeine helps it. I don't know if it helps it, but that's what I tell myself. Okay, and then spending also got hit by the fountain drink budget. Okay, put those to the side. So here's our leftover. A few ones and oh, an A, yay, and a J. Okay, so those will go to the side. And L, I don't think L we need. I think we need I and H. I and H, oh, and E. Okay, so we can't stuff our reinventing Renee. This will go in the pineapple. And this will go into the monthly binder for the end of the year. I'm really, I don't want to rush the year because it's going quick enough, but I really am excited to see what's in here at the end of the year. All right, so there's another deposit in April. These envelopes are from Mel over at Mystic Budgets. They are awesome. Go check her out. So we've got January, which I was very focused, February, March, and now April. So that's that. We'll put that to the side. Okay. And we are stuffing 761, 50, 100, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 84, 20, 40, 60, 85, 20, 40, 60, 86, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 97, 10, 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, and 61. I feel like these videos are boring and I am sorry if they are. It seems like I just stuffed the same envelopes and kind of the same amounts. But that's kind of just how my budget works out because I kind of divide them all by the same amount of weeks. Sometimes they change a little bit, but for the most part, I'm stuffing the same amount in each envelope each week. So I apologize if that gets monotonous and boring, but budgeting has done so many wonderful things for me in the, um, um, in the year. And I'm trying to think I started in December of the year before. So one, so 13, almost 14 months I've been doing it. So I'm going to stay consistent because Videoing keeps me consistent. Okay, so let's stuff our envelopes. Eating out is getting 50, 20, 40, and 50. Um, 
the boys. So Carson wasn't a big eater before. He would just order off the kids' menu typically. But he is starting to eat off the adult menu. And Jake, as a 15-year-old athlete, has been ordering like, not double meals, but like double burgers or <laughs> like an extra, like a, a meal plus like chicken on the side. Um, so it is not cheap to eat out. And we have been eating out way too much, way too much. Like, I can't say it enough, way too much. So I'm back to meal planning this week. I didn't bring my journal up here to share our meals this week, but I did start this week. So that's good. It is an incredibly busy week for us this week. So I'm really going to try my best to stick with it and not give in to the ease of, um, eating out. So wish me luck. All right. And 40 in groceries. Don't know that I'll have time to coupon, but I'll put it in there just in case. Okay. I don't know if you guys watch any of the couponing channels, but like Save with Alicia today had, um, a good Walgreens shop. And, uh, there's a couple other ones out there. I know, uh, GG Budgets has been posting stuff on Instagram and I watch a couple of the channels, Izzy's Budgeting and Couponing. I might have got her channel name wrong. I'm sorry if I did. Anyway, I watch them and I try to do some of those deals. Also, Lindsay over at Boy Mom loves to save. She has some good ones she sends me. So I've been trying to do that, but I don't know if I'll have time this week. Anyway, I am rambling tonight. Okay, let's get to stuff in. So, um... Work is busy, which is good. All right, HOA is getting 40. So they raised our HOA dues this year and I did not realize it. So I do not have enough in there. So I'm adding extra the next couple weeks to make up for it. And then I'll have to reassess. Just like anything else, it's gone up. All right, car is getting 100 car payment. All right, guys, so I do have an update on the car. 150, 220, 40, 60, 80, 300 here. Um, my car <laughs> got to the point. My husband's looked at the rotors. He's changed the rotors. He's rotated the tires. He changed the brakes. Um, he changed the oil. He's done. But my car still sounds like the front tire is literally going to fall off and I do not feel safe driving it anymore. It is only 10 years old. It is a Toyota. I could get it fixed, but there's also something going on in the back of the car. Like when I back up, it's like, Arr. I know sound effects are terrible for me, but anyway, I got an offer from CarMax and then I thought, let me see if I can sell it myself. So Saturday morning, I cleaned it up. I'm not going to lie, I didn't do a spectacular job at cleaning it, but I cleaned it up, got everything out of it. Car insurance, this is my last week of electronic, and it comes out next week, and then I'll start saving for it. And I listed it on Craigslist. Um, my husband was gone for the day. Soccer got canceled because it was, guess what, snowing again. And um, let's see, sports is getting 120, 40, 60, 81. And I put it on Craigslist. And within an hour, I had two people interested. So I was like, all right, you can come see it. And then I kept getting more people. So usually if you get that many people, it means you didn't price it high enough. But I was like, it's okay. I had a number in mind. It was going to be more than CarMax. It's fine. The first guy that came, he drove it and he said, your transfer case is out. Like, and he explained all the stuff and like he drove it and he came back and he like knew exactly. Anyway, I've priced it, what it would have cost me to get that fixed. And I did great. I will just tell you that. So the car sold first person. <laughs> My husband got home just in time to sign the title and it's gone. So I don't have a car right now. Well, that's not true, but 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 20, 40, 60, 86, 20, 40, 60, 87, 20, 40, 61, and 2. So I didn't quite get up to the goal here because this came out today, but this will get pulled and go to the bank and we will start collecting for the last month of this payment plan for baseball for spring and fall for Jacob. 
So, m my husband recently bought himself a newer used car. He has like a little commuter car. It's old, but it's decent. It's a standard um, shift. And he got himself a nicer car. Um, he paid cash for it. Uh, he doesn't like to drive it. It's his baby already. And he has a truck and then he has a work truck. So I'm just driving the Saturn and I'm going to take my time and I'm going to find the car that I want. While I'm doing that, I'm going to continue saving and the money that I got from my car will be joining this envelope next week. And I'm going to find the car that I want and I'm not going to settle because truthfully, the car that I had, I settled because I got cheap and I never loved it like the car before that i loved i loved my toyota 4runner it was my baby i had it for years it had over 200,000 miles on it like i loved it so i want to find a car that i love that i will drive for a long time so that's the story for the car i don't know how long it'll take me the good news is i don't have to rush the bad news is his little car is really small and I feel like I'm riding in a go-kart on the ground but sacrifices will be made it's fine okay so that's the update on the car Tolls is getting 10 sorry if I'm talking your ear off tonight all right so Tolls has 20 40 60 80 1 20 31 2 3 and 4 on a positive note I never renewed the plates that were due at the end of last month so I saved I don't know $90 there and um, I had them take it off our insurance that's due next week so now that's lower so that's the positive side of it <laughs> subscriptions is getting 25 and you're probably noticing a lot of these envelopes are a lot lighter than they were last time you saw them because I finally settled uh, my planner with all our expenses so 100 20 45 6 7 and 8 so this is one that took a hit when I finally um, settled it. All right, land payment is getting nine. I'm going to put a one in and take a 10. And then I'm going to put two tens in and take a 20. All right, so now land payment has 100, 200, 250, 270, 295. So once I do a bill exchange at the end of the month, I will put some of this in the high yield savings account now that we've paid this for this year. And honestly, I'm going to lower this payment because I'm ahead of schedule on it. Union dues is getting nine as well. And I did pay that. So let's go ahead and do a 10. So there's 30. And mom time is fully funded. So it's just getting the $1. 20, 40, 60, 81, 1 and 2. So I have not done deliveries. Um, I did some early last week before I thought my car was going to implode on contact. Um, I did a couple. So there will not be much of a side hustle video this week and probably not one next week because doing deliveries, driving a stick shift and that little car, um, I don't know. I might change my mind, but as of right now, I don't think there will be. Shop Small's getting $5, which I just pretty much spent a lot of online. 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49. Go check out uh, Marlene over at Snow Gardener 307. She's doing something really cool that she just announced. Go check her out. I love it. All right, car registration is getting 10. I am going to keep adding to this because if I get a new or a new to me car, I'm not decided yet. You know, that's expensive. So. 100, 200, 300, 20, 40, 50, 60, and 5. All right, and property taxes and homeowners insurance. We are not quite there yet, but we're getting close. Okay, now we're going to move to this binder. All right, household is empty. I did pay for the drywall. I'm getting reimbursed for some of it from insurance, but some of it was just out of pocket for something in our kitchen that has bothered me for years. And it looks so much better. It needs painted, but it still looks so much better. So this is getting 25 and we'll start saving up for the next whatever. 
Miscellaneous is getting five. I did not pull this. I might still need to pull it from that, but I don't, I don't know yet. 20, 40, 60, 65, 70, 75, 76, 77. It depends how we do for spending the rest of the month. We'll see. All right, gift is getting 10. We have Mother's Day coming up and we have some birthdays coming up. So 20, 40, 60, 81, 10, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29. Clothing is getting 10. I did take Carson to get some new shoes. He literally had a hole in his shoes and he uh, qualified for that hexathlon at school. So he's gonna be running a lot. So he got some new shoes this weekend. So some will be coming out of here. 100, 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 85, 90, 91. Entertainment is getting 10. And we will be using this this summer, I'm sure. So 100, 200, 300, 20, 40, 60, 80, 85, 86, 87, 88. So doing good there. All right, vacation, $20. This one, we're still trying to grow as much as we can. So there's 1,000 in a high yield savings account, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 220, 230, and one. And shoot, I forgot to take screenshots again. I'm going to add some screenshots so you guys can see I actually have that much in my high yield savings account, plus interest. I keep saying it, I keep forgetting. I will try for next week. All right, self-care is getting 20. And no, I haven't scheduled that haircut. Ponytails are the bomb right now. 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, and 200. This week I would not fit anything in, so I will just wait. Air conditioner is getting 20. So this week Carson has his hex athlon training. Um, he has soccer. Work is busy. Jake has uh, three games for the freshman team. Tonight he played, they asked him to play up to the sophomore team. Uh, he has practices. There's no school on Friday. There's no school on Monday. Um, I need to go up and do some stuff at my mom's house. So it's just a little crazy. So 1,000, 15, 16, 1,720, 40, and 60. And if you're new here, we have to get a new air conditioner and furnace. We're gonna try to do it in June. So I'm trying to save up as much as I can for that. Let me get these out of the way because they're kind of just bothering me if I'm being honest. Okay. And then next we have giving, which is getting five. I did just do a giving thing today. So um, this is going to come out of here because it was more than this. Good cause. And that's okay. All right. Debt is getting 25 and this goes to my mortgage principal. So now we have 20, 40, 60, 65, 70, 75. And I don't have a ton of change, so hopefully I can make some change going forward. All right, PTO is getting 20. And this is paid time off for my husband. 1,100, 20, 40, 60, 75, 6, and 7. That's adding up nicely. We'll just keep going with that. All right, driver's ed. I broke this one last week. Let's see if I can get it open with my no nails. Maybe not. Oh, is that hard to watch? It feels hard to watch. I'm about to cut it. I don't want to cut it. This envelope's going to last for a while. All right, I'm just going to put the dollar here and I will do it off camera. All right, and if you guys noticed last week, I forgot to put the five in holidays. Somebody pointed it out, so I did go and add it. But now I need change. So hold on, let me see if I can make change in one of these. Oh, I can look. All right, let me go back here. All right, so holidays is getting five. I'm going to put five in and take a 10. 
and we're starting to save up for the next holiday. And then P.O. Box is getting five, so let me pull that back out. Okay, and five, so 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 5, 10, and 11, so that's doing well. I do need to go check my P.O. Box. I tried on Saturday and they were closed, but I didn't have my car, so I didn't have the right key, so I just, I will try again tomorrow. This is senior year, saving up for the boys. This pretty sticker's from Busy Lizzie. All right, senior year is also getting five. Oh, do I have change? Oh, I do. Yay. Yay, yay, yay. Okay, so it has 100, 20, 1, 2, and 3. All right. Last binder, guys. Okay, and this next conversation is for some of the smaller channels. This is not pity. This is not me asking for sympathy. It's just real life. When you are a YouTuber, you want to see your channel grow. And then you'll see it grow and you'll see you get a big jump. And then you see it goes down. <laughs> and my channel still does that. I am over a thousand. I have gotten monetized. I have not gotten a check yet and that's okay. I am not complaining. I am super grateful for the people that follow me and comment and the friends I've made and the gifts of friendship I've received. Um, but I just want you to stay, stay with it. Don't give up as frustrating as it gets. Don't give up. And I do know that feeling. It took me a long time to grow my channel and a lot of channels grow quicker. They either catch on or they just have better content, whatever it is. And I am happy for them. Like I actually love to see channels grow really fast. I, I'm like, I just enjoy watching it and I'll check on them and I'll see how they're doing. I'm super excited for them. I am not, not no ill will to them. Just know, stay with it. It will come. You will meet some amazing people. You will be part of this amazing community and it is frustrating and it is hard to not compare yourself, but just be the true you and stay with it and keep budgeting because budgeting is gonna do more for you than YouTube is going to do for you. So if you wanted my unsolicited advice, that's it. I have probably lost 12 subscribers in the last three days and it sucks. That's, that's the reality of YouTube, right? They could have been bots. They could have been somebody that didn't watch a video before they subscribed. They could have been somebody that unsubscribed because I annoyed them. I don't know. It's probably all of the above. But don't give up. Stay with it. It's worth it. Even if it takes two years to get monetized or three years, I promise you the budgeting itself is going to do more for you than get, getting monetized for YouTube. Well, it isn't, it's cool. I'm excited to be monetized and I'm grateful for everybody that helped me get there. But I just wanted you to hear that from me because it's still frustrating, but worth it, if that makes sense. All right, car maintenance is getting 25 because we still have cars and they can still break down. <laughs> so I'm taking 10 and two fives and putting in a 20. Um, I hope that wasn't sappy. I hope that that wasn't annoying, but I, I know when I was trying to grow and how frustrated I got. And honestly, there was a couple of times that I thought about giving up and I didn't, I didn't give up. And I'm so glad because again, it's, it's worth it. All right. 100, 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 300, five and six. So that's just my spiel. Take it for what you will, but the budgeting is what's going to help you more than anything else. And I love watching your journeys and I love finding small channels and I want to cheer everyone on. I do. I want everybody to be successful. There is enough people here. We can all be successful. All right. Medical is getting 10. So there's 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 31, and two. So just keep battling. Just, just keep being you, but keep budgeting. Keep budgeting, keep filming it, keep holding yourself accountable. All right, Reno is getting 20. 
This is for new floors on my main level. So there's 500, 600, 700, 20, 40, 60, 80, 800. We finally hit 800, woohoo! 10, 11, 12, and 13. So this is growing. I'm hoping it can start growing more. I would really like to get new floors and start doing some updates to my house. Jake Savings is getting the normal five. Okay, so there's 50, 70, 85. And Carson Savings is also getting five. I'm gonna put 15 in and take a 20. All right, 20, 40, 60, 80, and five. Savings is getting 10. I do appreciate everybody that watches my videos, everybody that sits through the ads, uh, all the comments, all the thoughtfulness. Um, sorry guys, I'm stuck. 10. Um, it, it makes it worth it. It makes me keep coming back. 20, 40, 60, 81, and 20. There's just some awesome people out there. And I've even started like going outside of the budgeting YouTube world. Like I just found some stuff on plants because I like to do like a small garden, but I'm not very good at it. So I've been watching stuff on that. Education is getting 40, 10, 20, 30, 40. These boys are also eating lots of lunch. <laughs> 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 1, 110, 120, 130. Um, also sports. Also, lots of end of the year stuff coming up, so I want to bulk that up as much as I can. Roth IRA is getting the normal five, so it has 15. Invest is getting five, so it has 15. Jake's car is getting 10. All right, so now he has 500, 600, uh, 10, 20, 30, 35, 36, 636. So we'll just keep growing it. It's in the high yield savings account. Carson's getting five. And he has 100, 200, 300, 320, 330, 340, 345, 46, 47, 48, and 49. 349. New car will not get anything. And Christmas is getting 10. And I can already see I'm off again this week. Somewhere, somehow, I'm messing up my numbers. All right. That's okay. We'll put 10 in here and I'll leave the five there in case somebody tells me I messed up again. Cause I'm like, oh, for two the last two weeks. There's 100, 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 55, 61. 160, 161 in Christmas. That's good. That's good. I, I'm happy with that. All right, guys, that's all I have for you tonight. I probably will just have one more video this week. My side hustle and savings challenges. Um, <clears throat> because it's a busy week, I did get my credit card reports, 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 re <laughs> rewards. So I'm hoping to sneak in a game night, if not this week, the next week. I hope you guys all have a great week. I hope you're all starting to get some beautiful spring weather and flowers, and I will see you soon. Take care. Bye.